the first star citizen 3.18 ptu patch for wave one has been dropped today and we're gonna go right into it this time it's the 3.18 u patch and there's a few updates that they made to this patch and there's a few fixes that they've uh, also made in this as well um just to let you guys know um some of my community members have already mentioned that the patch seems very uh, they have seen some performance improvements with this patch so it's looking great some of the updates that they have mentioned here in regards to gameplay is they remove the nearby drop limits on inventory items okay the next one is ships and vehicles it says the corsair rest hype adjustments so they made some adjustments to the corsair um from what i remember it sits very low so i guess maybe they probably bumped it up a little bit it says right here actually uh slightly raised the corsair landing height extended ramp slightly further and the ramp angle is slightly steeper okay so um i guess this will help it land in um some of the more um harder to land locations okay so um also they said they tweaked the reclaimer lift speed to prevent uh damage updated salvage filler station to allow crafting of multi multiple items so now they did mention you'll be able to craft multi tools track the beam attachment and and all the other various attachments for it from the vulture um as well as i, I believe the reclaimer as well okay so that's that's really great news um core tech they also mentioned they made um physics polish pass as well okay so um there's a few bug fixes i'm just going to read a few of them it says the um transit elevators players fall through the elevators has been fixed um stanton leaving server session and rejoining to a new shard makes the players stuck in a long loading screen at a 205 um 20,539 entities I've, I've experienced this multiple times myself uh scanning not showing advanced statistics and details vehicle ui mobi glass vma um takes several minutes to load a chosen ship loadout performance ui client stall when entering the asap terminal rendering uh range yes i, I think i've seen that um ships abandoned on planets no longer appear on asop terminal so they fixed that asop console show information on another player okay i've seen that um the gp33 grenade launcher does does no damage and has no force reaction um active feature personal inventory move all so move all function is failing to move armor so they fixed that as well the vulture while flying in atmosphere the vulture will constantly input a downward pitch that must be constantly countered by the player um control inputs okay that's that's important so they fixed that so the player are able to log out of the constellation beds when under attack when other players are on board okay so it looks like they fixed that as well okay and um lod issues on right veto engine when uh viewed in external use so now this is regarding the drake corsair they fixed that all right um vehicle hall scraping code it's allow players to select salvage beam to persist um upon exiting the enter the re-enter um exiting and re-entering the seat okay so it also mentions here the merge between rivers and lakes is currently a very harsh transition with the terrain flickering in and out of that location okay so that's just a few of the fixes in this patch hopefully just wanted to give you guys uh, an update that this patch is out go out and test it out if you have access to wave one you guys already know what to do subscribe and like i'll see you on the next video